Andy Shepard one more time for a semifinal. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a welterweight semi-final contest. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. He stands six feet three inches tall and weighed in officially at 169 pounds. He has amassed nine wins and just two losses in his professional career. Fighting out of Miami, Florida and representing Jamaica, he is the number five seed. The Postman, Delano Taylor! And his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. He stands six feet even and weighed in officially at 171 pounds. In 33 professional fights, he has earned 23 wins, nine losses, and one draw. Fighting out of Montreal, Quebec, Canada, he is the number one seed, the Red King, Rory McDonald. Your referee in charge, Mark Goddard. Mark Goddard and the ref cam will oversee the main event action here in Cardiff, Wales. Rory is in the blue trunks, Delano Taylor in the black and gray. Right to the center of the cage they go. Immediately, Rory engages in some grappling. Delano Taylor trying to shrug off this early exchange. Inside trip attempt by McDonald. It fails and Delano ends up on top. Trying to get an angle to attack that Omar Plata almost does. Still has decent control, not quite past the elbow though. Delano in a nice position to limp arm out of that. Good work by Delano Taylor to use his shin to trap that right arm of Rory McDonald. Rory might try to swing back into a triangle. There he goes. Nice posture there by Taylor though. Dan Hardy, we're one minute into this welterweight semi-final. Is it going the way you thought it would? It's really not, to be honest. I'm right behind uh, uh, Faraz Zahabi in the corner of Rory McDonald, and I think they're expecting it to start quite fast for Delano Taylor, but then Rory McDonald's experience will come through in the later rounds. This is a slower start for Rory than I, I think he's anticipating. 90 seconds gone in the first frame. Shoulder pressure from the top position here for Delano Taylor. And, and this is going to be good for the confidence of Delano Taylor. Getting off to a start like this, stopping the takedown, getting top position here. You saw Rory as he was standing up trying to grab another single leg on Delano Taylor. Feeling his advantage is to get top position on the ground as he lands a jab. And then a one-two. Oh. Sharp jab and a hook there from Delano Taylor. Another. Yeah, that flick jab is looking really sharp there for Taylor. Good low kick there. Down to the calf of Roy McDonald for Delano Taylor. Blood trickling off that left eyebrow of Rory McDonald. Have to believe it was a jab from Delano Taylor that landed on that side of his face. Yeah, it's odd to see Rory kind of get away from his jab a little bit. He's trying to pump it out there, but needs to set it up with more feints. That was a nice slip and right hand there from Rory, but Delano really establishing the range very well so far. It seems right hand to the body. It, it seems to me that Rory just doesn't want to be in these exchanges. He, he's either looking for a takedown, which he did right away when they got into that range of exchanges. And he's changed levels and reached for it a couple times already and since then. Yeah, Rory looking a little tight here to start this fight for sure. Delano Taylor is fast and loose. 
and watching on intently. Already punched his ticket to a welterweight championship. Sadabusi is sitting cage side with the iconic Gareth A. Dan. Pressing in the first round here, isn't he? Really impressive, Delano. I believe, I believe he started very good in the first round. Uh, and uh, Rory, I believe Rory pressured a little bit too much trying to get the takedown. Oh, oh, Look at that side of his knocked him out. Rory McDonald down in serious trouble. And Taylor pulls the upset. Delano Taylor to a PFL championship. Ladies and gentlemen, your referee, Mark Goddard, stopped this contest at 3 minutes and 59 seconds of the first round, declaring your winner by TKO and advancing to the 2022 PFL World Championship, the postman, Delano Taylor! All right, welcome back to Motor Point Arena in Cardiff, Wales. Sean O'Connell here inside the Smart Cage with a winner by TKO in the very first round, Delano Taylor. Delano, you promised us during the week we would see a changing of the guard, but the only way to really signify that would be an emphatic win, a finish like this one. You made it happen. You made good on your prediction. How does it feel? Feels like I'm a, a truthful man. I'm a word of what I say, so I'm not surprised. You set up the finish with the jab, that flick jab, the speed. You cut him open, and then you saw the right hand did you, did you scout that out in camp? Did you know that those straight punches down the middle were gonna be the kick? I already knew I had power in my right hand, and I already know my jab is really hard to beat. Uh, my corner Zimpa, Landon, and uh, Sadu, they were telling me um, feet move, hands get the credit. So I was just making sure I kept my feet moving, kept the jab pumping, and set up the right hand when it was time to go. Sadabusi versus Delano Taylor, how does that go? Uh, I don't know, I'm intrigued. I don't know how that goes just yet, but I'm uh, I'm gonna be in the moment right now. Celebrate this win, and then we're on to the next. You know. Congratulations, Delano Taylor, from the Challenger Series to the 2022 PFL Welterweight Championship.